We feel like um, there's a real tendency uh, to look at, at ministry in, with a very narrow perspective um, that, you know, a pastor is a minister, you know, and that's it. But, but ministry really is much, much broader than that. And I think, you know, I think a lot of people at New Covenant understand that ministry goes so far beyond that it filters in all aspects of life. And we feel like that our primary ministry right now is to our family, uh, to my aging parents, and to our children, Joey, Bethany, and David, trying to raise them as, as well as we can and instill in them godly attitudes and values. In the period that we are with service to our family, it, it is not only um, our children that we are ministering to at the moment, but John's parents and um, they have we we just wanted to do life um, together with uh, John's brother George and Sarah his wife and uh, Bill and Joy John and George's parents and in doing life it's been a blessing to us because we can be together in this season of life. We moved uh, back here from serving aboard uh, the Africa Mercy uh, hospital ship it's part of the Mercy Ships uh, Ministry, International Missions Organization uh, that provides free surgeries for people along the coast of West Africa. Mercy Ships um, was something that I was introduced to when I was 16. I knew I wanted to be a nurse at that time. And it just I had a quickening in my heart when I was even a teenager to serve others in that way. And the Lord just planted the seed in John's life as well, so that when we met and we got married, um, we didn't even think about it at the time, but eventually he used, you know, has used us in that way, in that ministry. Um, even John with his passion for, for um, photography, um, that was drawn into it and he was able to do medical missions as a photographer. I believe that images carry a lot of weight and they have the ability to change culture, to change ideas, to change the way that people think, uh, to change hearts. I'm a photographer, that's part of who I am. Uh, I'm a visual artist of sorts. Um, I want to glorify God through the, through the skill and talent He's given me in that area. I love to see how people delight in His work. It, it, just touches my heart when people are excited about what he does and his photographs and things like that. I see that as his part of, big part of his ministry. Uh, for us coming out of three years of ministry where we were living in very tight quarters on a ship with people from all over the world um, was a, a culture in itself and uh, coming back from something like that it's very shocking to come back into the culture here in the U.S. It's something, of course, that we grew up in, but being away from it for so long, you had to uh, re-enter that culture, and it's shocking. We feel like one thing that's really important is, is trying to help people who are, are leaving full-time ministry, who are, are missionaries or, or not. Um, who are trying to readjust to life without that, you know, full-time ministry as being, you know, what they they do. So um, that that's something we feel very passionate about. We feel like um, the church could 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 work to improve. I mean, we really need to take care of um, of our soldiers, you know, who are coming home from the field. Um, uh, you know, we don't have veterans benefits <laughs> um, but but we need to work within the you know within the uh, the church uh, to find ways to, that we can encourage and, and help those who are are leaving leaving full-time ministry
One thing that I love about New Covenant is that it is real and uh, we value that quality in our own lives and in the lives of the people that we are in contact with. The church is very real and I also appreciate the fact that we are not um, compelled <laughs> to um, be of service at this point in our lives because we've come back a little spent and so it's been a blessing to just be loved and be a part in that way. We have ministered in Africa, we've ministered to our family, we've ministered to the people that we've ministered with, but all of our ministry has been all for one. This life I lose, I will follow you.